In more fees news, submitted by Lacey from Toronto. Oh, hey, Lacey. <gasps> Who's Lacey? From Toronto. <laughs> friends. She's from Toronto. You, anyway, Megan. <laughs> A DMV wants to charge motorists a $15 fee just for walking Fuck in the door. The DMV. <laughs> Fuck them. I like this idea though. I like it too. Yeah, Cause we're rich. Cause we're rich. <laughs> <laughs> That's when you know you're rich. You're like, yeah, charge us off. You should change your IG to Meg's Real. I love Meg's that. Real. <laughs> Meg Real Rich. Yeah. Meg's Rich. <laughs> Meg keeps it real up in this motherfucker. Rich. When I was at the DMV, I was like, why is it the AAA the only like business outside the DMV that's actually trying to do DMV shit? And it's ten times faster. Yeah. It's way better. I think but to it's explain only to our international fans in case they don't know what the DMV is. It's the Department of Motor Vehicles, which is a government office that you go in to get your driver's license or take your driving test or get your registration. No, it's and always there has fucking souls. packed. It's the it's worst It's always place. packed. There's lots of stand-up comics that do jokes about how long the line. Oh my God, yes. Yeah. It's about Every a two hour minimum wait. Every joke wait. about it. Two hour minimum process. And so now this one DMV in Rhode Island or actually, yeah, the Rhode they Island. They would. One. They would in Rhode Island. What? That's where all the rich people oh. are. No. So they are saying that they want to apply a $15 in person customer service fee. And that's in order to deter people from going in to do things that they could have done online. Mm. So it would apply to license and registration renewals, but it would not apply to real ID license renewals. So, so in the United States, we have to get this new ID called Real ID, and you have to go in person to get oh, yeah. it, or if not, you need a passport to travel in, uh, domestically. October so, 2021, I think. October 20, 2020, I think. Oh, 2020. Why? Damn it. Because now it's like more secure, like, I don't know. I haven't gotten it, so I don't know. Because they validate extent. your validation now. Exactly. I don't know, it's Do I get bullshit. a blue check mark? <laughs> no. <laughs> Again? Fuck, man. Like, I'm gonna get, I need I'll, to get them all. I'm gonna get you guys all blue check marks that <laughs> yeah. don't have it. Don't you have one, Nikki? Yeah, I have all of them except well, for. Well, that's what she the bit is. Which one? Yeah, I got it from, except for which one? I got it from subscribing to JK News. What's the except? Because what's people are watching us and they're not subscribing us. They're not subscribing to our, to our channel right now, so they should do it right they now. They should do it they so they can get it. that check mark. So all of us could get the check mark. And we will validate that you have subscribed. <laughs> I'm so stupid. I thought you were really going to get his check mark. No, I am. Oh, what? Well, oh, that's yeah. a story for another time. Can you give me one? <laughs> you put it up. <laughs> okay. I'll that's remember. awesome. Yeah, Do you guys hear the one about the three bears? Huh? It's a story for, for another, another time. time. <laughs> that's all you need to know. It's coming. Awesome. Well, I'll tell you how later. Okay. So I met The Rock recently. You met him? But it's a story for another time. time. <laughs> <laughs> I got excited. Oh, man, me I, too. I, was like, I looked at you like, are you going to tell me? <laughs> I was about to ask you so many questions. Yeah, it's a story for another time. <laughs> me too. We for another time. Now I want to see a playback of that reaction. Uh, <laughs> anyway. So, it's an in-person $15 customer service fee, and there's another $15 fee that they want to impose that would hit motorists renewing a license or registration that has already expired. Oh, fuck. Honestly, I will pay a fucking $100 to get in and get out in five minutes. Yeah. I would do oh, yeah, it. I would too. When, when I said we're rich, what I meant is that usually- Her bank account is loaded. What I meant is that usually when you go to the DMV, I have avoided going to the DMV to get another license because mine got swiped. Um, As in stolen? I've been stolen, yeah. My bag got stolen in Barcelona. Oh, no. So this was like almost a year ago now. I know it's really bad. I should get my license. <laughs> but I'm in Culver City and the line is like way out, like two miles away from the actual yeah. DMV every Damn. single day. Yeah. And if I didn't think that it was gonna, it would take me like four hours to get through the line and get and the maybe website more. sucks still. Yeah. Try a different DMV office. So fifteen dollars to save me four hours. If that many, let's say even fifty percent of those people were not gonna go because of the fee. Yeah, exactly. Then I would pay it. So if you hoping. make more than seven dollars an hour, it would be you're rich too. That's what I meant. We're not that rich. I mean, we would just pay the fifteen dollars <laughs> happily. Yeah. I'm with Joe. I'll pay a hundred dollars if you get me on in five minutes. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'll pay that it's shit. It's crazy because um. There I won't pay my employees, but I'll pay the fucking DMV to get me in the, in the front of the line. 
That's, fast that's for pass. sure. Yep. <laughs> have a DMV fast pass. That'd be so cool if there was fast passes for real yeah. life stuff. Yeah, because then you could go get your shopping done. You could, especially the one in Santa Barbara's next to Costco. You could go get all your Costco shopping yeah. done, and then you're like, oh shit. Now it's time. It's, it's, it's the window. I don't know. I, don't know. I just don't understand why they can't get it done right. Yeah. I have no That's idea. That's what I was gonna say. Is I don't know if this is actually gonna work because the problem isn't the too many people at the DMV. The problem is how slow they are. Oh god, they're the so The same bad. exact thing when you go to AAA. It just you, you can do things in under five minutes all the time. Yeah. So they can have less people, but when you go to a counter and they still don't give you eye contact, they still go fumbling through their papers, they're having the side conversation. Yeah, they have a lot of side conversations. Yeah, when I'm there, I'm like, is up. this your lunch hour? What the fuck? I went to go pick up my custom license plate, and it's just in a shelf, right? And I can go, oh, here's my thing, can I just get my license plate? They could have handed it to me, and it could have been an under 10 second thing. They're like talking, oh yeah, blah, blah, blah. They're like talking about what's happening on the news, and I'm like, what the fuck, and I'm here for like five minutes. Then all of a sudden, oh, I'm gonna clock out real quick. And then so that person no has to tell someone else. Oh my God. So he's here to pick up his uh, license plate to change shifts, and then I'm like, what the fuck? Why is there this giant fiasco when you can literally go like this? <laughs> like, why do you have to tell someone that, okay, this guy's here for his custom license plate, but now you're going off to lunch? It's just so, it's crazy. And they don't give a fuck. Me changing my address and getting my registration card took me like less than five minutes, but I waited for over two hours. Yeah. Oh, yeah. crazy. You know. Well, you know what else it is? Is an old people fee because like, even if they don't want to pay fifteen dollars, a lot of old people don't want to use the internet, That's my so mom. they're more scared. Yeah, me, mean, like me too. Like, so my grandparents, they don't know how to. Not my mom, but like my the, my grandparents don't know how to use the internet very well. My dad doesn't trust the internet, so he'll he'll like go in person. He still like makes physical checks and stuff. My mom too. Uh, yeah, he doesn't like pay bills online. Um, yeah, and so like there's old people that are like. Oh man, I don't want to pay fifteen dollars, but I don't know how to use the internet, so it's kind of an old yeah, people task. Yeah, because they're saying that the average uh, customer wait time, it it, w it used to be thirty nine minutes in twenty sixteen. Then it went fifty nine. It's never been thirty nine minutes. Oh shit! Well, this is for like the Rhode Island one. Oh, okay. Oh. And then uh, fifty nine minutes in twenty seventeen. And then 63 minutes in 2018. I bet I could like run a whole presidential candidacy on how fucked up the DMV is oh, and I'm win. I'm already voting for you. Yep. yep. Mm -hmm. I'll fix yeah. the DMV system. That's yeah. the only thing I'll people care about. DMV. Yep. In California was I think 400 minutes <laughs> in 2015, <laughs> and now it's like That's 700 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I know. And then like. I mean, for sure the DMV employees, like, I mean, I don't know what happens there, but just by viewing and witnessing, like, what happens when I go in, I'm like, this could definitely be ran better, but it's also the people that go in. Because do you guys mm -hmm. remember when we went for a motorcycle license? That, we were there for fucking four hours, know, what the like fuck? an eternity. And we went to, like, seven different windows. Like, we the did. first one. Check you have in, to drive one. to the okay. smaller but towns. I mm -hmm. Like, yeah. I dro drive 30 minutes extra to yeah, go, oh, really? Yeah, we did. I went what? to four of them. What I'm trying to complain about here too is like the the people's demeanor, like like us, like there were people cutting in line when we were waiting there forever, and it's just like the fuck, dude. Like oh, we had an appointment too. Yeah, we did. We had an appointment. It was four hours. Yeah. God That's damn. How do they cut in line when you have a number? Oh no, they cut in line security. to go get the number. Oh. Like there was this one chick, and then there were all these people too. Like this bitch just cut in line, and we're like, yeah, dude. There were like, security. There is, but they don't care. They're not trying to like. Pretty like yeah. They're old. all government employees. Yeah, yeah. yeah they should privatize it, because yes. then they could charge even more. Exactly. Yeah. Just like the post office. Oh, does that make me like some sort of like communist or something? No, it's the opposite. The opposite. opposite. The opposite. Yeah, Whatever it is, I don't yeah, know the no, word. That's why like everyone's like, oh, we need universal health care and blah blah blah, because then the government will. No. Like, the government sucks at running things. Even when I was broke, I didn't want the government to run shit because Same. even when I was broke, I hated the DMV and I was like. I would much rather pay more to get better services at AAA. Dude, there was this is one horrific experience that I had to, that it actually led me to like crying my eyes out because I'm like, I don't know what the fuck to do anymore. And it was because they were forcing me to do this thing over the phone. And like they they were making me say like the numbers, but like the like the alpha, beta, whatever, like the A mm. to say the letters. Oh my god, it was your accent? 
I don't know. <laughs> it could, probably could have been. But I could not for the life of me get them to understand what I was saying. And I'm like, no. And they couldn't let me transfer me to an actual hey. person. <laughs> and, then I was, and then I actually went in person and I'm like, listen, I can't fucking do this on the phone. They're like, sorry, this could only be by the <gasps> phone. And I'm like, oh my God, that's so oh, sad. That Isn't it crazy that's when you go there, there are things that you could only do on the website. That so you so go there, stupid. but you, you, the only reason why you're there is because the website's not clear. Exactly. So you go there and you go, can you help me with this? And you have to go back on the they website. They don't want you to win. They don't. But are they gonna take this $15 and give it to more efficient workers or something? So they're saying <laughs> that this program, um, wait, let me see. Uh, that they're, the budget request they're seeking, $2.2 million next year to keep extra staff working after next October's deadline to get real IDs. And so they're proposing that by doing this $15 fee that they will be getting an additional $1.5 million a year. It's so stupid, because then why can't teachers get more money? Like, it's also run by the government, schools and stuff, and then they're like, hey, taxes and stuff, and then they never give it to the teachers. Mm -hmm. But then this, they're like, let's invent something where people have to work extra, the real ID thing. Mm -hmm. And then and then we'll charge the people more, and then we'll give them money. They should oh. work for tips, <laughs> exclusively for tips. Oh, yeah. Ooh, at the DMV? Yeah. Then they, they'd be nice. They know they know what car you're driving already, so they know who to oh, treat well. <laughs> oh, wait, what the fuck? Oh, no. You flipped it on us! I am like, um... <laughs> you're on another one. You're like, yeah, but they might fuck goes, themselves because... First she goes, we're rich. <laughs> then she goes, uh... <laughs> wait, I think they should privatize this company. <laughs> and then she goes, well, they know what kind of car I drive. I'm gonna tip them. <laughs> but the real rich ones are like driving Camrys yeah, and that's stuff. that's true. Damn. So, that backfired. <laughs> yeah, that's hilarious. Fuck the DMV, that's all I gotta say.